Hi, everyone. I'm Dylan McGee, founder and executive producer of Makers. Welcome to Makers at Home Live. I'm uh, pretty excited about our guest today, 11-year-old Sky Brown. We met her at the Makers Conference back in February, and she was on her way to the Olympics in Tokyo for skateboarding, the first time ever for men and women. Um, and she was she is very much an Olympic hopeful. And then the world changed. Um, and uh, so we wanted to check in with Sky. Uh, also, she's recently had a pretty severe accident, um, but in true Sky Brown form, she is uh, inspiring us with her extraordinary recovery. Um, and most excitingly, she has a book coming out. So we want to talk to her about that. So here we go, Sky Brown. I'm coming to you live. Hi! I did it! I, I did, did it. it! How are you? I'm good. How about you? I'm doing well. Well, that was a little stressful. Get, Of course, nothing stresses you out, right? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> no, you don't get too nervous. No. <laughs> no? Um, okay, Sky. So tell me. You recently had a pretty crazy accident. What happened? What, what happened? Well, so you probably have seen it or not. Well, so I was at Tony Hawk's Ram. I was just skating, you know, like I usually do, just skating. But this time I was, I've been, I went over that channel before where I fell. Yeah. I was just doing it. I was just like flying over it. But this one, I got unlucky because the trick before, the trick I did before, it was like a spinny thing, but I'm flying backwards, so I couldn't see where I was going. So I just realized, oh, I'm done. Then I went, ba ba. Oh. And what, and, and then, but but you posted, so you went ba ba, you landed on your <laughs> hand, and then your head landed on your hand, right? Yes. Yeah, so I honestly don't really remember. Yeah, I bet. I'm, I think I tried grabbing, do you see like the wooden thing that yeah. was on the middle? I was yeah. trying to grab that with this hand. And then I Who guess knows? I land, this hand saved my life, I guess. Go hand, that's your right hand? No, it's my left hand. Oh, that's your left hand. I, you know, it's all turned around. <laughs> I don't know my right from left sky. <laughs> all right, so, but then you, so there was a video of this and you ended up posting it, it the starts with the video and then you were in the hospital and you were kind of saying encouraging words to all of us so tell me first of all what did you tell everybody in that video and then why did you post it i forgot what you said <laughs> i remember but i i wanted to post it because somehow people already figured it out like i was getting dms text messages people were so worried like people were like are you okay oh my gosh i heard what happened and then you know there was already some things that were going on like with the black lives matter thing and i didn't really want them to worry about me mm -hmm. i wanted them to worry about you know what's going on with the world right now because you know there's a lot of weird things happening and so I just decided to put it out. Like my parents didn't want me to, but I'm like, everyone's worried or I don't know how they know, but I just want to put it out. Oh, Sky, you're amazing. It is, and everything you say is always so inspiring. <laughs> um, and I remember when you were um, at the Makers Conference, and I think when you were there, you first of all, you were the hit of the Makers Conference. Uh, we had a little, I know it was so lame to you. We put up a little half pipe, but for you, it was probably just like a little toy. Um, I, I mean, I liked it. You know, I, I grew up skating mini ramps, so that was fun for me, but I didn't know about Tony Hawk because, you know, he skates those big things. I like big I, things too, but I skate mini ramp too. <laughs> has he been a role model for you? Yes, it's just so cool to see, like, He's not like too old, but like it's just cool to see someone that is like older skating still, because that's what I want to do. I want to keep on skating and just cool to show people that age doesn't matter, you know, and that's what I want to do too. I want to show that age doesn't matter. So it just, he's really cool. 
Well, you're already showing that age doesn't matter, right? You're 11, about to be 12, right? Yes. You have a coming? birthday coming up, and I want to talk about that. But um, so you were on your way to the Olympics. How did it feel when you found out that the Olympics were being postponed? It was, I was, it felt like my dreams were fading, but it felt like it was going away because, you know, that was like, my dream was to go in there and skate in. It was really close to. I know. So I like, ah! But then I realized it can be a good thing too, you know, you get a longer journey. It's cool to see girls progressing. Like I'm looking at videos and people is getting so much better. We just, it just makes us have like a longer journey and just got to enjoy it, get better. And yeah. Well, so, and so you're ready for Tokyo 2021, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When do you, when do you start to train again? Have you already started or you're, I mean, with your arm, you can't really do that, right? Yeah, I, it, yeah, I can't really bang it because, you know, I have so many fact like, broken things in here, like so many cracked things in here. I can't really do it. And I'm close to getting it off as well. So I'm like, I don't want to mess it up. But I've been skating, which is bad. But I've been skating a little bit with straight with my parents and with my, yeah, with my dad and my brother because, you know, like when I first got out, I just remember seeing them going to the ocean surfing and I was like, oh, I need to skate. Please just let me skate. So I did it for a little bit. I'm still taking it a little I'm gonna go slow. Don't worry. I'm not gonna get on. Um, take it baby slowly. Baby steps, but... right, Sky? <laughs> baby steps. Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay, but you have <laughs> the other things. I saw the other day you did. So you've been doing a lot of TikTok, and you did a yeah. little. You even had a hip hop lesson, right? Yeah, that was really fun. You know, that's like. Now's like a good time to do it because you know, I don't know. TikTok has been really helping me and. Dancing has helping me is helping me so much because if I didn't have dancing or I didn't if, if I didn't do that hip hop lesson I'll probably be like so jealous because my brother and my dad is going in the ocean and I can't so it's helping me <laughs> ah that's right so you I mean because you're so energetic you gotta have something to do right <laughs> yes otherwise I'll be crazy all day <laughs> I know that's so good well now. Speaking of other things, like you're unstoppable. You're, you know, you're a skateboarder, you're a surfer, but you're also now an author, right? You just wrote a book? Yes. It's actually right here. Show it's me. Big. So I don't want to spoil it too much, but I'll show you. Show uh, me a little. Okay. So it's sky brown, sky's the limit. Words of wisdom from a young champion. It's... I don't want to spoil it, but I'll show you one page. This is I'm just picked. I just picked a random page, so it's so just it just well, I want backwards to... sky, so I can do a lot of things, but I can't read that. Will you read it to us? Yes, you can do anything, even if you're scared. I was scared to try dancing, but I got that exciting feeling that I get when I dare myself to do a new trick or try something new. It was 100% worth the risk. <laughs> so yeah, um, I wanted to make it because, you know, I, I want to, my goal is to, like, that's one of the reasons why I want to be in the Olympics and just to spread a message like, because I feel sometimes girls are scared to do what boys can do. Like, I don't want to be mean to the boys or anything. Like. Boys can probably do it better. Girls can do it probably better too. But I just like want girls to know that you can do anything that boys can do. Just got to believe in yourself and have fun. So that's basically what this book is about. Just in, like inspiring things, like inspiring girls and how to do that. Well, you're constantly inspiring. <laughs> so what if that someone was just asking, you know, if something's getting you down, what do you do to overcome your fears? Well, I honestly, like, I don't mind when people says that. Like, I don't mind if people say, hey, you're too young. You can't do that. It just makes you want to go hard and show them that. Just prove them wrong. So I honestly don't mind. You can say it. Just, I'm going to show you what's up. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> so you don't let people get you don't let people get you down. You just show them. Yeah. That's your way. Yes. Yeah. And boy, can way. You, boy, can you show them? I mean, I'm <laughs> telling you. What was it like writing a book? It was pretty cool. I mean, like, it was just cool looking like oh, at all the photos and all the memories, you know, that was cool. And this, yeah, it was cool. <laughs> cool. Oh, wait, somebody wants to know which do you like better? This is a hard question. Surfing or skateboarding? Okay, so this is how I like to explain it. I can't choose, I can't choose which one I like better because, you know, if you eat too much ramen, you wanna go and get some ice cream. If I do skate, if I skate too much, I wanna go and jump in the water and surf. It's basically like that, so I can't choose. <laughs> <laughs> do you ever think you'll go to the Olympics for surfing too? I'm thinking, not at this Olympics, I wanna, well, this Olympics, I want to do skating, and the next one, I'm going to do surfing. That's what I'm trying to do. What else, so what else do you want to be when you grow up? You want to be a professional athlete. Any other dreams? Well, my dream is to go to unprivileged places and teach kids how to skate, because, you know, when you skate, you for, when you do sport, you forget about what you're struggling through. Yeah. You just think about that, learning the trick and happiness. So that's what I really want to do, and... Find some other fun things to do, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> do you love travel? I love traveling. I love being in different countries. It's cool to, like, eating different food. I love trying anything new. So I'm just anything new, I would try it. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are you going to try? What are you going to do for your birthday? What are the plans for your 12th birthday? Well, I would love it if I could go to Waco, which is like a wave pool. So oh, I saw has, that like, on your Instagram. That's amazing. It, I, I think it's a, yeah, it's, it's really fun. It's just Or like maybe it was a different thing on your Instagram, ever. but it's one of those places where they make those huge waves and you get to. Yes. And I get my cast off before that. So I'm like, yes. <laughs> now I've noticed some people have their cast signed. You just kept yours clean. I didn't know what I was trying to do. I think my original plan was to get like signed and make it glittery, put some stuff on it, but I didn't know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, Sky. Well, I'm gonna let you go because this is too fun, but I have a couple more questions that I just wanna know. Okay. Like, where do you think all your confidence comes from? Um I didn't know. You don't know? Just, ever since I was little, I just had like a fire in my heart, you know? Like, I just wanted to show girls because I'll be like, I'll be the only girl skating and I'll be like, no, like, I just had a fire in my heart. Good. How about your parents? How have they inspired you? Um, I guess my dad was skating. My dad was skating, and that made me want to skate, so I guess that was a little bit of an inspiration. But really, they didn't want me to skate or anything. <laughs> but they're both very funny. They, like, like to make me laugh, and I don't know. <laughs> How about your brother? Are you and your brother both competitive with each other? Yes, we are. Like, anything we do, we're like... I'm gonna beat you, God. I'm gonna beat you, Sky. I'm gonna beat you, Ocean. Like we're both very competitive, but at the same time, we both love each other. You know, we both best friends. So, who's the better skater? I we both do different tricks. <laughs> <laughs> you are very good, Sky. You're very fair. Who's the better surfer then? Same thing. Yeah, we both have different style, but maybe surfing. I can't say it because he's right downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, Sky. Well, what are your, if you had to, right now with Makers, you know, we have so many amazing women and girls watching this. If you had one piece of advice to give to the girls who may not have the confidence that you do, like, what would you tell them? Just... Don't care how people think, 
believe in yourself, but most of all, have fun and do it because you love it. You got to do it. Do it if you want to do it. So would your advice to me be if I want to go and start skateboarding at almost 50 years old? Is that a good idea? Should I do that? Yeah, you can do anything. Doesn't matter how old you are, how young you are. How young you are, you can do anything. Just, you just gotta believe in yourself and don't think that you're gonna fail. Like, don't think that you're gonna fall because if you do, you're probably gonna fall. Just right. stay to it. All yes. right. Well, if I'm really gonna take, if I'm gonna take your advice, then you better teach me one hip hop move because I have never done it. I'm not that coordinated, <laughs> but I feel like if you can teach me. I can do it. Are you game to do that? Will you teach me something? Yeah, I guess. Should we do, do you it? you want to learn? Well, I'm going to move my camera here because I need a little room, right? So I took my first hip hop class the other day, so I'll show you like a little bit of it and see if you can learn it, okay? Okay. All right. I'm ready. So you go down, like throw it down, I guess. like. You can't see me, but I'm doing throw. it. Yeah, throw it down, then you go, woo, -hoo. woo, then you go, okay. that oh, one, two, put your fingers like that, I can't point it, but like, one. Wait, show me again. So like, put your fingers like that, I can't point oh, it. Oh, like that, okay. So yeah, so you go, one, two, three, pull it back, pull it back, down, slide to the side, and then woo. Woo. Yes. All right, let's do it all together. Okay, ready? ready? Got it. Three, two, one, go down. <laughs> one, two, three, boom. 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 Down. Down. Slide. Slide. Woo. Woo. <laughs> all right, everybody. This is Sky Brown sending you so much love from App Makers Women. You're amazing. And we can't wait to see, follow you all summer long and all the way to the next Olympics. And everyone, make sure you get that Sky Brown book, right? Yes. It's right here waiting for you. Right there waiting for you. Sky Brown. <laughs> Bye, Sky. Bye. Thank You're you. You're the best.